please. Oh, I mean contestants, I'm sorry. Uh, folks, welcome to the 2014 Super Tech Competition. Monday, um, our 10th anniversary. Thank you all for being here. Wish you all the best of luck. Quick thing, we're going to bring you in in groups of 10 and move you, uh, your workstation chair will move you to the work first workstation. They will show you where to go for the rest of the day. of Super Tech. Welcome to the 2014 Super Tech Competition. I'm George Aarons. I want to talk to you today about our two new uh, concepts. We added a student competition this year. We have 23 students going through eight workstations. All of our students were sponsored by industry members. We're trying to bring industry and education together to actually fill the pipeline for a future workforce. We've also gone to a team concept to where the fleets now can pick uh, two of their technicians 
and then we can measure the teams also. It's something that they have asked for. Hope everybody enjoys 2014 uh, Super Tech, and thanks for all your support. Hi, I'm Mike Meredith, I'm the chairman of PTDC. Uh, this is Super Tech Competition 2014. This year is our 10th anniversary for the competition. Year over year, this competition has grown and gets better and better and better. We had 134 contestants this year on the professional side, 23 student uh, contestants this year for a student competition, and by far this is probably the best competition that we put on to date. Exactly 7.40, and he will say, I'll start. The next voice you will hear is my horrible voice over this PA system you will not see me. And you will hear the sound five minutes. Well, here at the 10th anniversary of Supertech, just been thinking about what happened from year to year. The one thing you find out is that you never know what's going to happen from one year to the next. This is the 10th anniversary of the Supertech competition, and it's done really, really well. Conversations with some of the fleets, the participants in the Supertech are known throughout the fleet in all of the jobs and have, have risen these guys to a great level within their own organizations and the industry.
Union Station, we are very detailed. We check and recheck. We usually have a couple teams of two that uh, go through the process once and then tabulate and then retabulate and sync. Uh, we check everything multiple times to make sure that we're accurate. It's something we take very seriously at this boring station and we love it. We're so proud of the techs. What's it like to be a station chair for the PMC? Has its rewards, but also has its challenges. <laughs> as far as the logistics of moving everything in and out, we work with uh, every one of these uh, uh, trucking companies and fleets uh, to line up the trucks, get them in here, try and get them scheduled all at the same time to arrive at the right time so we can get them all in in order. Hi, I'm Chuck Roberts and I am with uh, ASE and NATEF and AES in uh, Leesburg, Virginia. I've been involved with the uh, Supertech competition since its inception in Valley Forge. This competition has changed significantly in those 10 years. It has just grown tremendously and we're looking for uh, more and more. We have the students here this year. That's the first for this year or for the competition. And that really, I think, is the future of, uh, of uh, truck technology is, is, is getting the students involved and getting connected with the employers here and the fleets that, uh, that, that are uh, going to be there. Five minutes, five minutes, and one more rotation. Ha, ha, ha.